I'm Yvonne Morgan, I'm one of the ambassadors for Thursa. And the show, The 39 Steps, um, I have not like read it or anything like that before I went in, so this is only what I can take from it. But the basic plot is there's a man called Richard Haney, who's the main character in The 39 Steps, and his life's quite boring and dull. You know, it starts off with him being quite depressed because his life isn't really going anywhere. And then all of a sudden, he goes to see a show in the West End and he meets a spy, a German spy, who completely changes his life and then he meets a host of different characters. And that's what happens and his life just ends up, you know, finishing perfectly with a wife and a baby and perfect, basically. Good, wholesome story. I just loved the comedy in it. The actors were so good. Well, and the actresses. Um, every character, there was the one man that we'd had the talk before the show and he'd said that it would taken him like 30 years or something like that to get into the business and I was like, how? He was so good and his comic timing was brilliant and every character he played was so different. You know, he'd obviously spent a lot of time differentiating the characters and the main character just had that perfect British kind of spiffing man about him. He he basically got it perfect, spot on, and every other character. I mean, honestly, some of the women ones were a bit... I couldn't really define them. I mean, that's not even a bad thing, but, you know, I couldn't say that that was British spiffing or that was such and such. But they were still good characters, especially the German spy, because she's the catalyst, basically, of the show. Like, the comedy was really well done. Um, like... At the start, you you weren't quite. There was like a few things that were supposed to be mistakes, and you weren't sure if they were mistakes. But then they came on, and you realised that it was, and it was really funny. And um, I thought they really brought the like um, the whole play to life. And it was like the audience was really um, kind of in the play in the moment. There was like no fourth wall, but it was good. Uh, my name is Jack, nearly, <laughs> and uh, I saw three nine steps. Yeah, it was just really, really good. Like everything. That they did was so well done, so well rehearsed. Um, I think the thing that sort of stuck out for me was the kind of really interesting and new, unique ways of how it used set, um, you know, the way they used props. It was, you know, it's nothing I've ever ever seen before. And I think it, the way it was done, it really just added to the comedy and the the uh, actors as well. Their comic timing was just, you know, it was brilliant. They, you know, they had the sort of audience in the palm of their hand and they knew when to, you know, you know, just go a little bit further and yeah, so it was, you know, the, those were the kind of two things that, which really sort of stuck out for me. Um, you know, the actors were just, there was so much energy as well, so, um, you know, it all really came together quite nicely. So, I'm Hannah Danson and we've just seen 39 Steps which is about, it's a sort of 1930s spy film, but it's really funny and I really liked the slapstick humour with the Alfred Hitchcock references and it was very adventurous uh, but not too overwhelming, sort of like action packed and I really liked the costumes and the set design. Um, my name is Alanis McLeod and I'm the Eden Court Creative Ambassador for Invergordon Academy. Um, I think overall I liked the show, um, I liked the humour because I, I don't think I've seen anything like that before so it's quite nice to see something that a bit different and um, sometimes I thought the comedy was a bit overused, like some of the jokes got a bit old, but um, it's still funny I think, really funny, so it was good, yeah. Uh, I'm Anna Wheeling from Goldsby and I saw 39 Steps, I thought it was really really good, it was really funny and fluent and the cast was quite small but all the characters were really well developed. Um, the, the comedy between, like, especially the two men, I think they said that they were called, like, the, they changed characters so many times, but it was so, it was so well done, and it made it really, really funny and good. So, yeah, and also, like, the, the, the stage was small, obviously it's, it's meant for a book or a, th or a film, but they used like people and aspects of staging so well to make it make it funny and make it clear as well. So I thought it was really well done. I'm Charlotte Fails and we saw the 39 steps today and it was really cool because it's different. Like they came out of character sort of they could dress the audience in a sort of offhand way and it was really cool because I don't know what to say that's fine, it's really just about your opinion. Um, um, not really up. I did enjoy it. Um, 
but some parts, like the guy that was like, couldn't speak properly, it was a bit awkward because it didn't seem to end and it went on forever. So, yeah. I'm Ailey Prescott and we saw 39 Steps and it was really good. Uh, it was good because you had to use your imagination and it was really funny and I loved it.